And let's add the last part of the tree. Oh, it did you evolve a little bit? Oh, you son of a bitch. <laughs> I thought we were just about done, but no. What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to Quarantine. I'm your host, the Birdman, known as Falcon. Before we get underway, let me give you a small little Falcon fun fact for you, by the way. Did you guys know that I'm the person who wrote the hit song from the 80s, South America by Toto? That was actually me. You know the song, right? I fixed the rain down in South America, blah, 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 all that jazz. That was actually me. Just a little bit of a fun fact for you. I'm pretty sure you got it now, right? You got it? Okay, I hope you got it. Anyway, we're doing a pretty good job of keeping the bacteria um, quarantined to a significant part of the world, or a small significant part of the world, I guess. I do see, however, that Madrid is trying to jump over to New York, which would be pretty bad for us. So I think since we have $30,000 here today, we want to go ahead and make sure that we quarantine Madrid. We're not going to have enough money to get the other research facility up and running, I don't think. Because it costs 20000 without the diplomat, and, um... Well, it yeah, it costs 20000 without the diplomat, and this is going to drop us down to fifteen if I'm right. So, let's go over to... Or unless... Wait a minute, wait a minute. Let's go to Madrid here really quickly. I, I want to say... Let me see, Quarantine City. Oh yeah, I, I was hoping that the security guy would be able to drop this down to uh, 10,000 or something, but it's gonna be 15, huh? So it doesn't matter who I use, it's gonna cost me 15,000 regardless to Quarantine Madrid, huh? Alright, well, so be it. Let's go over here to Quarantine City with the security, Seth the Man. Oh, 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 before we do that, before we do that, we have a tech available to us here. So last time we uncovered body armor and we got the disease has negative one intensify actions per turn so before we do that i, I like the idea of disinfects so i'm not gonna lie to you we also have operatives have less chance to get damaged during operations which can be very useful because i really hate having to arrest my dudes um operatives receive more experience that would level them up and this would be healing restores 100 percent health i like this one and i like this one cities treated to zero infection level cannot be reinfected this sounds really good, man. Like, it sounds very, very good. Let me get this infect. Yeah. Uh, I wish I had enough money to get some engineers happening, but I know, I think we need, like, a, a longer run for that to actually go down, because we don't have enough money for that. So, uh, we'll pick up this infect for now. Let's go back over here, and let's go back to Madrid. And we'll go ahead and quarantine Madrid down with the security guy. So, we'll start this operation now. Come on, buddy. No damage. No damage. No damage, indeed. Pretty cool. So now we have made sure that this is not going to jump over to the state side over here. And Africa down here and South America over here, you know? Because this is North America. <laughs> okay, I'll stop, I'll stop. Brain farts, dude, brain farts. Alrighty, so let's see. 15,000 left over here today. Um, that's not going to be enough for another research facility, I don't believe. Let me go over to Moscow just to make sure. I'm pretty... No, we don't have enough money. 20,000, yeah. So we have... Do we have samples enough for this? We are doing the samples thing, right? Yes, six days remaining. Okay. Now, can I gather more samples for the next part of the cure? I believe we probably should be able to. So how about... You're still in London, right? Uh, scientist lady? So let's do a sampling operation down here in London. Uh, three damage is gonna happen here. That's because of the body armor. So instead of five, we got three, which is actually pretty good. Let's do the operation over here with Mia Monte. So two more disease already. I I'm picking these up now because I know once we get part of the cure over here ready, we're gonna need more samples down the line for some other research, I have to imagine. So that's done. Now we have the two medics left over. The infection level is pretty decent, so I guess what we could do is go to Rome and Istanbul and try to get rid of the infections there momentarily. Um, Chengdu is still in the quarantine, so we don't have to worry too much about that. So yeah, let's go to Rome. And, and you know, as they say, while in Rome, Go ahead and cure the disease. Is that how the saying goes? I'm not sure that's how it goes, but that's how it goes in my world. So, Monica Madsen, do a advanced treatment down here. And no damage, and she leveled up. Is that level 3 for you now, or is that 2? Oh, so we have two of Mimetics at level 2 now. Excellent. Alrighty, and now we'll go to Istanbul. Advanced treatment. We'll go over here with Hans Schroeder. Hans Schroeder. No damage with Schroeder, ya. Yeah. Alright, so everything's good here. Oh, London has one as well. Oh, we'll take care of London next time around. At least we know for a fact that it's not going to jump over to New York, which is actually the good thing here. So let's end our turn. We got $45,000 now, which is going to be enough to get the next research facility up and running. And because of the negative one intensity fight thing that we got, it's helping us out quite a bit. 
As we see, Madrid, it's not trying to get through Madrid, nor is it still trying to get through Chengdu, so that's actually going pretty well for us. Okay, so now at 45,000, let's go ahead and get the last facility up and running, and we'll do that with... I'll go with security, Seth the Man. So establish on... Wait, wait, what do you mean? We can't build an office here. This city is not connected. Oh, it's not connected to the infected area, right. Uh, we already have one in London. Do we have one in Rome? No, we don't. So we can set one up in Rome. Let's do that one with um, set over here. And cool. So now we have all four that we can actually build. I'm pretty sure you can level this up or increase this um, with... A particular skill, I have to imagine. But right now we're at 4 of 4, so we're making $40,000 a day. We have 25000 left over, which is indeed enough to quarantine something else if we wanted to. But you know what? I'm going to actually start saving that money up to pick up some engineers and some techs as well. So, with three people left over for actions, we obviously do want to go with more sample gathering over here. So, uh, sample operation. Go for it. No damage. Excellent. And now we have my two medics left over. And while we're at it, I guess we might as well bring down Rome and London to zeros as well. If we had the disinfect ability already, this would be actually very ideal, but we don't, so... Boom. And Rome is next. Boom. Very cool. Alrighty, so we have the infection level down to two right now, which is great. Quarantine where we had to quarantine. Um, I, I would like to maybe quarantine even Tashkent. If I quarantine here and here, it won't be able to spread further down this way. Although, Riyadh does have a chance of uh, infecting Terran as well, which would kind of get around the quarantine. So maybe we could do one, two, three if we really wanted to. Cairo could also infect down here. I guess Cairo would be the most ideal one to quarantine next, huh? So we don't get um, Africa down here <laughs> infected. Africa. Okay, let's go ahead and end our turn for now, though. We have 40,000 coming up now, and we do now have enough money to get a tech. Oh, Cairo. Cairo's making a move. Cairo is making a move now. Cairo, what are you doing, dog? You know how I feel about this, Cairo. I don't want you, um, proceeding with the infection. Let's do a quarantine over here. 15,000 is gonna give us 50,000 left over. Which I think is enough for at least a lab technician. It won't be the tech, but it could be the lab. So let's quarantine over here really quickly with Set. We took a little bit of damage, but it's only two, luckily for us, because this guy is a security dude, and we have that one skill as well. So it's not going to jump over to Africa, which is great. Okay, with this done, 50,000, let's go to the lab. Higher research so we can speed up the process? Absolutely. So we're going to be broke, but I think it's worth it. We now have two researchers hired, which should speed up our little um, duration when it comes to the cure itself. Let's go back. I almost hit end turn, which is no good, because we have three people over here idle still. Okay. Let's go over to Madrid. Get a couple more samples if we can. Took, um, no damage. Oh, and she leveled up, so now we can actually gather up to three samples, it does seem. Very, very ideal. And now with two of my medics left over... Hmm. I'll be honest, there's really not much I have to worry about them right now. But can we go to Madrid and do a treatment here? Just for the experience sake alone would be ideal. No damage here, and let's go to Cairo. And advanced treatment. Boom. We're having so much luck right now, I'm telling you. Like, off-camera, I was struggling really badly. But I think my failures off-camera really kind of made me a bit more aware of what's happening. Plus, we've had a pretty good distribution when it comes to the disease where it was located. Off-camera, I had like one over here, here, and here, so it was kind of spread all over the place. So it was kind of like really hard to maintain. But with this run, it was kind of like all in one single area, which really helped us out. And we got the proper skills to make sure it didn't spread as well. So yeah, the intensity level up has been really helpful for us. We got one more day until this is done. We have 40,000. I'm going to save my money because if we do that, we might be able to get another lab dude, another tech dude as well. So at this rate... I mean, I could spend money for a quarantine, sure. I mean, if I still want to do this over here, block this off completely, that's a possibility. But I'd rather just go for the tech people, you know? So, um, with that said... We only really have one infection down here, right? Well, <laughs> if that's the case, uh, Monica Madsen handled that one. I might even go ahead and rest. Oh, she took damage. I might even rest Set for this one here today. So, Set, where do you want to go and um, vacation here for your little, um... Rest. Let's send you over to Argentina and Buenos Aires, huh? How about that? Heal yourself over here, my man. There you go. And... Oh, no, no, no. Don't do that. 
Let's go to Moscow. Let's go to Moscow and pick up a couple more samples as well. And with my last medic, to be honest with you, since our infection level is completely at zero, there's not much you can do. I don't have to rest you, so I guess we'll just end our turn. Sucks for the experience boost, but you know, otherwise, what can you do? And Tashkent over here did have a, a build-up. Which is what I'm telling you that I kind of want to quarantine a bit. But as long as we use... I'm gonna use Monica for this one more time, because if she does get hurt again, then we'll get rest her up completely. So, let's do advanced treatment over here with Monica. No damage? Nope. I'll rest her next time. So now we're under control here. And by the way, our tech is done. So we have 33% of the cure already set up now. Excellent. And let's see. Let's add a trade now. So this has been researched. Let's go over here. Now we have the lymph node and we have the rodent flea transmission. So we have enough samples I have to imagine. Let's go with the lymph node. It's going to take us four days now because we have four samples. Actually, before we do that, hold up, hold up, hold up. We got, we could hire right now. Let's go to lab. Let me hire another researcher. Three of four now, baby. So three of four. Let's go with this one again. Duration, three days now. Excellent. So we should be able to get this under control really soon, guys. And if we get this done here right now, we'll probably jump over to the virus or the prion stage next if you guys want to see some more. So keep letting me know if you want to see some more and I will do so. And disinfect is also... Oh, we're done with disinfect. Oh, that's going to basically lock it up for us, I have to imagine. Uh, but yeah, let's research this trade over here, and let's go back. Actually, let's go to tech. Disinfect is done. Alrighty, so now we have disease screening. Negative one spread action per turn. Man, with this right here, we're basically done. Mutation inhibitor. This will be very useful for the virus, which has a really high mutation rate. So once we go to virus, we probably want to focus down this path instead. But this one over here is actually very ideal for... Bacteria. That's what I'm noticing right now. This is the bacteria one. This is probably for virus and prion. Who knows? Um, so, uh, yeah, I'm going to say just do the disease screening at this point. Let's go back. And unless I just completely butcher it up right now, this should be a win for us. I don't really see us failing at this point. Um, well, let's see. What do we got here? I guess we could grab a couple more samples from London. Worked out splendidly. I think we should have enough now for the next, um, part of the cure as well. So I think she's practically done. Infection's at zero. Screw it. End of turn. Yekka Tedimberg. It's starting to act up a little bit, though. Alrighty. So, I, I would say, uh, we'll give her that rest that we talked about. How about you go over to Mexico City, you know? Go, go, go hang out with Mexico, go, um, I don't know, protest or something. Who knows what's happening in Mexico these days with the whole U.S. and Mexico thing happening. I don't know. I don't really keep up, man. I just really don't keep up. Politics really isn't my thing. Um, let's see. Monica Manson, let's go over to heal the operative over Mexico City. Catch yourself a nice little mariachi band while you're at it down there, you know. Uh, so with this done, what do we got? What do we got? 70,000. Let's go to lab. I'm not really even to worry about the tech now. The faster we get this research, I think the faster we're done here. So, one day remaining now. Excellent. My birds are going crazy outside again. I'm not sure what's, what this whole week. They've just been fighting and fighting and fighting. I think they're kind of like all in heat or something. Which, you know, I've been there as a bird myself. Um, let's do advanced treatment down here with Hans Schroeder. I think they're all in heat, though. They've just been, like, you know, going at it with each other. Like, literally going at it, if you know what I'm saying. And they're all kind of like, no, no, it's my turn. No, it's my turn. Uh, I think we're done with this turn here. Disease in London? Oh, oh, you're trying to move up in the world, aren't you? Disease. Well, actually, not disease, but the bacteria. London and Riyadh, huh? Well, with the disinfecting that we got, we might as well keep hitting these places up with our medic people. In London. Over here. And so we got 60,000. We filled up our lab team at this point. Let's go over to... I guess we'll just pick up a tech dude. Not that we really need to, but, you know, whatever. And let's add the last part of the trick. Oh, it did you evolve a little bit? Oh, you son of a bitch. <laughs> I thought we were just about done, but no. Um, okay, we have the fomites and we have the... Let's do the rodent flea, I guess, first. This will only take two days, luckily. So research this trait now. So this bacteria is indeed trying to evolve. I've read that the longer you go in the game, the obviously 
the harder it gets because things start to evolve and spread faster. So even though I was over here saying it was over, you know, things could turn awry. Um, I think we're practically done, but I'll go to Moscow and get a couple more samples if we can. Just to make sure it doesn't evolve any further, and if it does, we have the samples already ready for it. Let's end our turn over here. What are you doing now? Rome? In Madrid, it wants to get through now. Okay. So we might drop a quarantine here again. So let's quarantine with Seth the Man. Cool. And while we're at it, well, I mean, Madrid's quarantine, Cairo's quarantine, and so are you. Oh, check this out. If we go over to Moscow, we could stop the spread over here. We could just basically quarantine these two bad boys and just keep it here completely, and we're done. So Moscow, let's quarantine yet again. Um, we'll probably have to use a medic for this one. Now, let's just use the, the, the scientists, because I think we have enough samples now. Alrighty, we have 10,000 left over. And we are also done with the disease screening. <laughs> oh my god, we're just bawling right now. Um, boo, 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 let's, uh, let's do accelerated training, I guess. Start that research, go back one more day until we get the other part of our bacteria here researched. Um, infection levels at one, that's gonna be Rome. Send Monica over here. And that's done. Let's end our turn. We're at 50,000. Moscow is trying to break through, man. Moscow, you need to relax up there in Russia, okay? And this is done. Okay. Two more days. Two more days and we should be done. So research the trade. Go back over here. Uh, Moscow wants to get through. Let's actually drop that quarantine and instable now since we have the chance to do so. And now we know for a fact this disease is not going anywhere other than the Chengdu one over here. But because we got the disinfect, I want to say Chengdu should no longer be a problem either. So at this point, we have now completely quarantined it up here. Up over here. Above South America. I know, I know. Above Africa. I know, I know. I'm just testing you guys out now. Let's um, end our turn then. Because we're practically done. Oh, never mind about Chengdu. You're, just, you're trying to get froggy over here, Chengdu? I thought we were good, man. Well, infection level's still at zero. Got 75,000. No reason not to drop another engineer over here. And let's just end a turn. No, I got a tech. Wow, we researched that really fast. Oh, one more operative could be hired. Well, at this point, we don't really need them, but sure. End our turn. And this should be it. This will give us the cure. Uh, I'm not sure what happens when you get the cure, though. Oh, you just went straight up! Hey, How about that? How many turns was that? Like, under 20? If that was under 20, I gotta tell you, I'm actually quite proud of myself here. Reason? The cure has been found! Damn right! And th that's it? <laughs> no, no fucking parade? How about like a politician talking and yammering on like how we did it, we bit the disease? I would've liked to have seen that. I mean, it's an early access game, so there's still a lot of development to come. Um, they're working on a campaign is what I read too, so I want to kind of really look forward to that one. So right now what I would say is we probably... Let's do... Go to new game over here. Let's do... What do you guys think? Virus or Prion? I know this isn't live, so it's really hard to kind of get your feedback on this. Yeah. Uh, the, right now the, the, the scenarios are limited. All of them are just fine to cure. I know they're gonna add like different wind conditions down the line. But right now it's an early access release, so all of them are indeed fine to cure. I'll probably do Virus, because it seems kind of cool. Prion, very similar to BSC, managed to infect several people around the world. It seems to have a hard time crossing city borders, but it's extremely contagious within cities. So, increase infection rate in infected cities. So, whenever a city is infected, it just builds the bar up even higher. While the virus just likes to mutate. I think the, the idea of a mutation virus could be a lot more interesting for us to check out. Because I want to see the prion is almost just like the bacteria, just with a higher increase rate when it comes to the buildup. But virus mutation sounds pretty cool, doesn't it? So we'll give virus a try next episode. How about that? Because I think we're out of time here for today. So let's, um, should we even try it on hard? Oh, should I just try it on hard and get wrecked? Screw it. Let's try it on hard. Next over here, and let's see, let's see. Who do I want to start off with this time? I, I like the idea of Medic. Um, this is going to be Mutation, right? So Mutation... We might need more scientists for samples for Mutations, I would say. But I'm not sure if I like them as a startup class. And especially with Hard, it might give us more random options. So the Security one might not be too bad either. But Money could be very important as well when it comes to... Hard mode. 
Let me go with the Diplomat this time around, because I never even used him last um, run, right? Yeah, so let's go with the Diplomat. Um, in terms of our headquarters this time, I'm going to say we go with... Uh, we did LA last time. Let's go with Tokyo, Japan for this one. Why not? So we'll go with Tokyo, Japan. We'll do hard mode and virus. So I'll uh, wrap it up here. We will catch you guys next time with virus hard mode.